it's five o'clock in the morning. Sean Evans here at Lift Doors and Thrills. Jake, what are we doing in Manchester Airport at five o'clock in the morning? Well, we're going to Abu Dhabi. Yeah, morning. <laughs> We are flying with Etihad Airways. No, we're not tagging along with the pilot and the staff at the moment. We're trying to get past. After a brush down and a cavity search, yeah. we're now out of security. We're boarding. Woo. Safe trip, safe trip. Ooh. One day, one day. Passenger gets a pillow a blanket, a wellness kit, and some headphones for your in-flight entertainment. Using our in-flight cameras, we can watch the takeoff. Always a favorite part of any flight for me. I am a sucker for plain food. I don't know why, I love it. A few moments later, we have arrived. You're probably asking, why are we in Abu Dhabi? Now, we're exploring Yaz Island, which is a tourist destination consisting of Ferrari World, Warner Brothers, Sea World opening later this year, a water park that's currently under refurbishment, an F1 track, an Abu Dhabi F1 track, and lots, lots more. Right, so Yaz Island actually run a free shuttle service if you are booking a hotel. And we are going to be going to the Centauro Hotel, I believe it's called. So hopefully we can get on the right bus and uh, show you around. Just outside the airport, you can see a bus with Warner Brothers in Yaz Island written all over it. That was probably the easiest transfer I think I'm ever going to do in my entire life. It's like a little party bus. We're the only two people on the bus other than the driver. Bus drops us off there and we are in the Yaz Plaza, our hotel, for the next two days, the Centro. Guess how much this entire trip was? Think of a number. Guarantee you you'll be wrong. Doesn't feel real. Hello. Ooh. Hello. Second floor. Order a scan key card. Key. Indoor. Oh, huge. That's not a bad little room, is it? And you come in, you have the bathroom. What's the view? Well, it's just everyone, everyone's hotels. Yeah, and back into like Dubai. Oh, not Dubai, Abu Dhabi. It's actually the cheapest hotel that you can get currently on Yaz Island for our particular trip. It's not bad for the cheapest. To be fair, the whole trip hasn't been bad for the cheapest. It's, it's actually cheaper than a stay at the Alton Towers Hotel. And it's also cheaper, the entire holiday that is, than the new Jumanji hotel rooms at Chessington. Wow. Going for a bit of a wander. Going to find the mall and get some drinks and things and... Yeah. It, it don't feel like we're... It feels weird, mate. It feels very weird. Feeling suitably overwhelmed yet? Yes. Good. Good. <laughs> you should have seen his face going over the F1 track when we went over the bridge on the shuttle bus. So that... <gasps> Walking past stuff like this massive sign that says Yas Marina Circuit is just making me a very happy boy. It's a nice little walk to places, I must say. No, I know why they do shuttle buses now, because it, it's everything's very spaced out, but it's nice. And just in front of us, there's an attraction we'll be checking out tomorrow, and that's Ferrari World. Home of the coaster in front of us, Flying Aces, which possesses the world's tallest non-inverting loop, and it's also home to Formula Rossa. The world's fastest roller coaster. 149.1.1 miles an hour. Expensive perfumes, expensive perfumes, expensive watches, expensive perfumes, expensive watches. It's absolutely huge. 
food court full of absolutely everything from Big Macs to Burger King to Don German Doner Kebab to the full works. Absolutely everything and quite affordable too. That's a lot of food for nine quid. That's not bad at all. Drink included. Lovely, lovely, lovely. Robots are taking over. The robots are taking over. Goodbye, Jake. All I could hear was the thing rattling. <laughs> oh, this is special. God, I miss the Toys R Us near us in Stoke. Oh, wow. If some poor unfortunate woman has my child one day, I'm definitely getting it. A baby Bentley stroller. Um, there's an indoor theme park inside Yasmo. <laughs> Mainly a kid's indoor park, but no way it's got one of them. Also, in other news, look how big the McDonald's large is. It's ridiculous size. Um, they've got an over-the-shoulder restraint indoor coaster called YOLO Works. That mall, you could be in there for days. Yeah. You could go in there and come out with a beard and it'd be like, understandable, it's huge. Gonna head back to the hotel, gonna chill out. Up at six o'clock tomorrow morning. The next morning. Sean, what are you doing out here, you cry? I'm in the gym. Starting our day here at six o'clock in the morning. On Yaz Island, in the gym. Me, in the gym. The best thing is, our trip hasn't even really started yet. <laughs> Ferrari wheel doesn't open till 12, so we've just literally just got some chill time just to just relax and take it in. As far as views go, that isn't that bad at all. Right, we're going to get ready now to go to Ferrari World, our first attraction um, on the list uh, as, as the reasons to why we've come to Abu Dhabi, to Yaz Island. Thanks for watching this little travel video. Hope you've enjoyed it and uh, I'll see you in the next one. I'm still blown away. I'm still blown away. Goodbye.